right, next game has to do with fractions. Who can tell me what a fraction is? Yes, ma'am, right here. Something that's part of a whole. Part of a whole, absolutely right. And the game we're going to play right now is called Fraction Action. And to do that, we're going to get two teams of four. Bob, will you choose two of uh, four from over here? Sean, over here. What Kid Prob does is it, is it does integrate the curriculum into their performance. So when you see math, and you demonstrate fractions, the students have the opportunity to demonstrate a half, a quarter, zero, or a whole. And they're going to remember that because they actively participated in it or they watched their friends participate in it too. Each one of these guys is going to represent a number in this. It's going to be a competition. When they're standing up, they're each equal to the whole number one. So this team right here equals to what? Four. Each one equals the whole number one. Now, our first fraction position is going to be on the knees. So sir, would you get on your knees right now? That is the half position. Now I just changed the value of this team, didn't I? Yeah. It is now what? Three. Three and a half. Very good. That's the unique part about Kid Prop versus another theater area is that it does incorporate the Texas essential knowledge and skills. Sir, would you get on your belly? Your belly. Now, that is a zero position. So I just changed the value of this team to three. three. Very good. Stand up, please. I'm going to call out a number. And you, as quickly as possible, without shoving each other down, but you can converse, you can talk, you can confer, you will then create that number by using your bodies. Got it? Two and a half. Two and a half. Two and one half. <laughs> The children really liked the Kid Prov program, especially the math that was just here at the school. Um, I had some children go up on stage actually as volunteers who you never see speak in the classroom. They're never involved, but on stage when they were invited, they actually became a part of the problem solving and they were very excited. As we came back up the hallway, they were like, this is the greatest. When are they coming back? They absolutely loved being involved in a thinking activity where it was fun. Okay.